Every once in a while, a tool comes along that's so well-liked, its name gets associated with an entire category. And that's what happened with the Milwaukee Sawzall. Before long, the name Sawzall was being applied to any tool that looked like it. But the people that use the real Sawzall know that looking like a Sawzall isn't nearly enough. The 15 amp motor in a real Sawzall is strong enough that you need a variable speed trigger and a speed control dial to keep it under control. The motor really is 15 amps, but Milwaukee motors always seem to run stronger than other 15 amp motors. The grip area is comfortable even with gloves, and the trigger and the speed control are easy to get at. The front of the saw is easy to grip whether you need your hand under it or on top of it, depending on the cut. You can adjust the position of the shoe using just this lever under the front end. And Milwaukee replaced the hex wrench with this twist collar for changing blades. This tool free system makes changing blades on a Milwaukee Super Sawzall very quick. Plus you can install the blades upside down using the same system if you need to do an upwards cut. It's really that fast. And of course we're going to need blades and I found this set from Milwaukee that gives you both wood and metal cutting blades. You also get this case that has plenty of room inside for the blades you get with this kit and a bunch more. And this coming from Milwaukee, their engineers figured a way to make this case shorter when you don't have a long blade in it. I got these blades and the case for under 20 bucks. This saw also has an oscillating blade controlled with this slider switch. Put it all the way over to this side and you get the full blade oscillation. Move the slider to the other side and all of the blade oscillation is removed. And you can position that slider anywhere in between to vary the amount of oscillation used. Of course, it's when you actually use the Super Sawzall that you see all of the benefits. Here I'm finding that the speed control works best when you actually use it. Even though I have it set way too low, the Super Sawzall just chugs right along and chops through the piece anyway. Another nice thing about the Sawzall is that you can make a whole bunch of cuts without expending a lot of effort. And when the materials change, you don't need another tool, you just change the blade. Milwaukee makes a huge array of quality blades that will handle just about any cutting situation you can find yourself in. Here I'm going to cut this 2x4 with no blade oscillation. I did use the speed control though. Now I'll move the slider to the other side to engage all of the blade oscillation, which often works very good for wood. And you can see how much faster it goes through. If you work with metal, wood, or anything in between, a Milwaukee Super Sawzall can make your life a lot easier. And because most times you can just change blades rather than changing tools, you can save a whole lot of money in the process.